How's it going y'all? Today I'm going to show you the easiest way to complete Call to Arms in Red Dead Online. If you guys need help, you can always join the Discord link in the description below. So let's get straight into the video. Firstly, you want to queue up and join the Blackwater Call to Arms. And once it's started, you want to head over to this location on the map right here. It's like a back alley. You want to climb these boxes up to the roof. And once you've reached on top, you want to equip your weapon and aim your weapon. So your character will walk slowly. Here's the tricky part here. You need to land on this thin wooden stick here. It may take a couple of tries, but once you guys get used to it, it'll be easy. Once you manage to land on the thin wooden stick, you want to go to first person mode, turn around and just go inside of the attic here. Once you're inside, basically nobody can shoot you from the outside. However, you can shoot them from the inside. Also, I would recommend to do this only after the 4th or 5th wave. Basically, you have to wait until all the ally NPCs are dead. So that way, all the enemies will actually come to you instead of the ally NPC. And you can simply shoot them all like in the video. I think around wave 7 and above, you'll start getting this knights wearing heavy armor. You might need to take a couple of shots to kill them. You might not be able to kill the chariot with the railgun as they're gonna wait for you outside. But nothing to worry about as the enemies will keep spawning and coming at you until you kill a certain number of them until you completed the wave. Also, sometimes the enemies might get stuck. You might have to get out of the attic, uh, kill the enemy and then climb back up and redo this process. So once you've cleared every single one of the enemy until wave 10, you should be able to complete call to arms easily, solo, or with a friend or a group. So that's it for today's video. If you find this video useful, be sure to hit that like and also subscribe to the channel for more future Red Dead Online content. This is Joe and I'll see you next time.